guy. Will he be my test patient? <gasps> yes! And? I will. What is it? I just need to check your blood pressure for practice. Yes! And I'll roll up my sleeve. Great, just sit down. Yes! And I'll spin around. What? What? What are you doing? I, I'm just, I'm <laughs> sorry. My theater prof's making us do these weird acting exercises today. This is for improv. It's called Yes And. Why? Yes, to accept someone's idea and to build on it. <laughs> what is that gonna do? Hey, is it a good time to fix the stove? Yes! And, let me show you where it is. I think he can figure it out. It's the light bulb. Let's have a look. Ah, huh, there we go. Wow, how did you do that? It was just loose. I wonder how that happened. Is your arm okay? Yes. And... Do you want to help? Emily needs test patients. Oh no. Yeah, sure. What do I do? Lay down on the couch right here. Oh, sitting is fine. Okay, just put this up. Should I take my shirt off? Yes! And. No, and. That's good. This one. Yes, and pump it up. Yes, and thank you, Skylar. Can you hand me my stethoscope? Yes, and I'll warm it up for you. <sighs> How is it? Um, a little high. Oh, I wonder what would be causing his blood pressure to rise all of a sudden. Thanks. Don't forget his heart. Sorry. It's all right. Is he healthy? You seem healthy. Shh. I'm counting. Oh. What is it? Do you have an irregular heartbeat? Oh, my phone's buzzing. <laughs> it's... I'll just ask her to come down. Her? Who? Yeah, my girlfriend. She's upstairs. Girlfriend! Uh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> just put this on, it's okay. <laughs> Maddie, oh my god! What are you guys doing? <laughs> Nothing. Nothing. Nothing at all. Why, what are you doing? I thought you had class. Better go see what she wants. Did you fix the stove light? Yeah, all good. Oh, okay. Bye. I was supposed to be here. He just showed up. Oh, what happened to school? I got asked to leave. Why? I fell asleep in gender studies. Oh no. And then I tried to apologize, but I got my teacher's pronouns wrong. Right, that prof is non-binary. Well. What did you say? Did you say she, her? I said mom. Okay, it's not my fault, all right? I just woke up. Let's make you a TikTok. Yes, please. Uh, what are the hand gestures for again? Mm, my life goals will appear. So you'll add them later. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like visualizing my destiny and then stepping into my future. So what are your life goals? I don't know. I might just do a poll. Ah! Skylar? Ah! It's okay. It's just another acting exercise. Ripping a dress? Yeah, this is called a moment of truth. Yes, and? No, I don't do that anymore. Now I just say and do what I feel when I feel it. Ugh, this is gonna make me a better actress. Okay, but why are you feeling this way? They just announced the cast list for a class production. You didn't get the part? No, I got a part. 
ugly stepsister. So I guess I don't need my princess dress anymore. The one I wore as Cinderella in our high school production of Into the Woods. Because apparently in the real world, I'm a character actress and not a leading lady. Okay, do you think there's maybe a more healthy way for you to express your moment of truth? <gasps> like burn it. Or we could do the exercise with you somehow. Oh, you guys don't have to. Hey, that's what friends do. Yeah, I just, I don't really want to rip my clothes. All you have to do is just say and do what you feel when you're feeling it. Only censor yourself if it'll hurt somebody else. I'm getting like truth or dare vibes. What does this have to do with acting? To be honest on stage, you must be honest in life. You can start small though. One girl in my class did it at Taco Bob. You were in the bathroom? No, she had a moment of truth. She asked for extra cheese and she didn't get it. Normally she just let it go, but she spoke up. She got extra cheese and a free burrito. We were all so proud of her. It was life changing. Okay, let's do this. I want a moment of truth. Em. Okay, um. Just say whatever you want, whatever you're feeling. Maybe something you're holding in. Mm, okay. Maddie, this is a safe space. Just open up. Maddie, you always use my shampoo and your makeup takes up too much space on the bathroom counter. <laughs> she broke the rules. That was hurtful. Well, no, 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 it's okay, it's okay. Sometimes little wounds come up, it's better to expose them. We learned that in nursing. Clean the wounds, don't let them fester. This is gonna make us stronger. Let's spin again. <laughs> Maddie, moment of truth. It really bothers me that you guys don't like, comment, and share all my posts. I commented on your post the other day. Uh, which one? The one where you were doing the tricks with your tongue. Okay, I've had like five other posts since then. You guys are supposed to hype me up. Okay, I didn't know you felt that way. I am liking all your posts right now. And if you share one, I'll buy more shampoo with my parents' credit card. Sharing. Remember guys, the moment of truth doesn't have to be a complaint. Like, for my turn, I could say that I really love you guys for doing this with me. You helped me to feel better. That's my moment of truth. Oh, Sky, you're sweet. Oh, I want to redo mine. That's okay. Just do one at school tomorrow. In real life? Yeah, totally. Just say and do what you feel when you feel it. It can be like a philosophy of living. Okay, so like if I don't understand something in class. Speak up. Be honest and fearless. Or if one of my followers reposts my post without crediting me. Tell them how you feel. M, are you in? So if there's a cute guy in my study hall I've been wanting to talk to? How do I love thee? Let me count the ways. I love thee to the height and breadth and depth my soul can reach when feeling out of sight. Okay, just say what you feel. Say what you feel. Hey, you hot, smart, sensitive guy who studies here at the same time every day and smells so good. I love thee freely as men strive for right. I love thee purely as they turn from praise. I love thee with the passions put to use in old griefs. I love thee with the breath, smiles, tears of all my life. And if God chooses, I shall love thee better after death. Sonnet 43, the most romantic poem in the English language. 
Romance would be so boring. Young lady, do you have something you wish to say? No. Sorry. Actually, yes. I do. Say what you feel. Say what you feel. Hey, um, this is for you. came after you. Yeah, he like chased me down. He chased you? What is this, a rom-com? I know, it was so sweet and he doesn't even know me. But he said nobody's ever done that for him before, so it worked perfectly. Did you get his number? I did, and we're having a study date tomorrow. I don't know how it'll go, but we talked and we're both studious, so. Doesn't matter, you did it. Amazing. Yeah. Oh my God, these moments of truth are life-changing. Yes, they are. Did you do one too? Mm-hmm. Spill the tea. What happened? I told my professor how I felt about his class. Okay. That it was a total waste of time. Oh. And then he asked me to leave, so I went to the admin office, and I had another moment of truth. Okay. I dropped that class, and three others. Wow, you really went for it. Do your parents know? I think that moment of truth is going to have to wait. We can do hard things, right? Right. You okay? My cat used to sleep on my bed. Yeah? And sometimes my mom would laugh so loud it would wake me up. Missing home. <laughs> and my mom's cookies. Tell her to send me the recipe. 